Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and I am standing in front of one sweet 1955 Chevrolet pickup truck. This baby's been chopped, channeled, it's had a 427 big block 512 casting put underneath the hood. It's got custom interior, custom bed on it. It's been narrowed in the rear end. It's got big fat balonies on the back and you're gonna love checking it out. So go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com. We'll put it up in the air so you can check out how cool the bottom side is. We're gonna pop the hood, take a look at that 427. We're gonna look at the custom interior. We're gonna show you everything you need to see so you can make a great decision on this 55 Chevrolet pickup truck. So come on up and let's fire this 427 up now. So check this baby out, man. Chrome grille looks good. Chrome bumpers brand new. Headlight surrounds look great. And take a look at the pinstriping on this beauty. I'll tell you what, a local pinstriper did that work and he is amazing. It looks great. The paint is popping and smooth as can be. We got more of that custom pinstriping here and on the wheel well. Great looking set of wheel and tire combo on it. Doors open up smooth as can be. Look at those jams. Custom interior looks great. Door panels look awesome. Carpeting looks great. It's got a tilt column in it. It's got an aftermarket setup there on the gauges that fits right in the stock location. All the paintwork in there looks good. The upholstery on the seats is in great shape. Headliner, everything about the truck is amazing. Just looks beautiful. Now check out this custom bed too. Look what they did here on the inner wheelhouses. Isn't that cool? They actually took an outside fender and cut it down for the inside. Doesn't that look slick? The wood floor looks good. And then they took a uh, Chevrolet uh, out of a tailgate and put here in the uh, nose too. All the paintwork back here looks good. We got our fuel fill right here also. Billet aluminum here, covering it up. So check this beauty out, man. The pinstriping on the tailgate looks great. They blacked out the Chevrolet, which looks great. I love the taillights. Look down the side of it, straight as an arrow. Now there is one little star in the fender here where a rock must have flew up. Door operates nice and smooth. Beautiful. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we're not consignment dealers. That means we own this truck. So we spent the time to go and pick this baby out and pay for it. We own all of our inventory. And what that means to you is, you got my 35 years of experience picking this baby out myself. So we're gonna pop the hood on this baby, we're gonna take it out there in the shop, we're gonna check it out, and then we're gonna tell you everything you need to know about this vehicle. We inspect them top to bottom so we can answer all your questions. All right, we're in this badass 55 now, and I tell you what, nothing sounds like a 427. Listen to this baby. I tell you, this thing is sweet, guys. Hey, we got some weather this week, so we're not gonna go out and drive this beauty because the roads are like crap right now, so we're just gonna sit here in the showroom and think about driving. I tell you, I've done this in my car more than once. Go out in the garage, look at that dash, all lit up, looking beautiful all in the stock location, just like Chevrolet would have done it. We got a tilt column here, the horn's working. Now, it's got an aftermarket radio in it. I'm not getting any music out of it, but it is coming on. A uh, low car shifter here, um, columns all polished up, paint work looks good. We got some instructions here. The uh, battery shut offs underneath the uh, passenger door there. Now, the doors do have electric poppers. They're uh, right underneath the edge of the bed. Um, we do have a, a mechanical handle right here to open and shut the doors. Uh, truck's amazing, guys. We can ship it anywhere in the world. You give us a call at 248-974-9513, and Tom will tell you just how easy it is to ship this truck anywhere you live in the world. 
And if you need help with financing, no problem there either. We got two bankers we work with, 10, 15 minute phone call with the banker, and this dream's in your driveway. So give Tom a call at 248-974-9513. And if you'd like to come visit us, we're only 20 minutes from the airport. Hop on an airplane, jump in your car. We're here on Saturdays. No problem, guys, whatever you need. Now stick with us, because we're gonna put it up in the air so you can take a look at that uh, 427 from the bottom side, the back half job. Man, it is amazing. Listen to that music. All right, we're underneath this 55 now, and man, she is just as cool underneath. You can see it's got a custom gas tank in it. Somebody is an awesome welder, I tell you what. The TIG welding on this looks amazing. Now we got a Ford 9 inch in here, right around the 323 gear, and it is an open rear end. We have disc brakes in the back. You can see the narrow job on it looks great. They did a beautiful job. It's got a brand new exhaust system. It's got uh, Flowmaster mufflers. The frame's all painted up. The bottom side of the cab's all painted. The uh, floorboards, you can see, they look like they're brand spanking new in the uh, trunk. We've got the uh, power booster here for the brake system. That's an old uh, Ford um, off a of T-Bird. That's how they got the power brakes on this baby. The master cylinder's mounted up here. Uh, turbo 350 trans here. It's got a set of headers on it. Running boards are solid as a rock. We got jump lugs for the battery. Let's see, the battery is mounted. Where is the battery on this thing? Is it, uh... here it is. Battery's mounted right back here. So you got your jump lugs right up here. So it's real easy if you need to uh, charge the battery or jump it for any reason. We do have disc brakes up front here. Front frame horns are nice and straight. Uh, we got a good looking radiator in it. We do have a power um, box there on the steering box. So it is power steering. It does have a mechanical fuel pump on it. Guys will check all the steering gear out. I mean, really an amazing looking truck here. It's got, the, uh, it's got a GM front clip added onto it, so you've got your updated uh, front suspension. Uh, lower control arms are all cleaned up and all the springs and shocks and everything looks great. I mean, just an amazing ride here, guys. Now let's look at those wheels and tires. All right, up front here we got Weld uh, Racing Lightweights. Uh, let's see if I can find the size. 205-7015s. Again, the inner wheelhouses are all painted up. Paint work looks good right down to the bottom edge. Let's check the rear. All right, back here we got some deep dish uh, welds. Uh, we got Mickey Thompson rubber here. These are Sportsman's. Uh, let's see if I can find the size on here. Oh, where is it? It's here, oh, there it is. Can't see anymore. 31, 18 and a half by 15s. Now let's get under the hood and take a look at that 427. So this is exactly what you want to see under the hood of this baby. 427, it's a 512 block, guys. This thing is amazing. Uh, like I said, power steering, um, alternator's been chromed up. It's got some great looking valve covers on it. It's got a 750 CFM Holly carb on it, HEI distributor. Uh, set of headers on it, just beautiful. You can see the frame's been all painted up, the firewall's been shaved, bottom side of the hood's all painted up. They've painted the radiator to match the rest of the truck. The motor's all painted up. We got beautiful chrome everywhere. We've got all polished up aluminum. It is a vacuum secondary carburetor. It does have a manual choke, but the choke is not hooked up on it. Uh, truck's amazing, guys. Give us a call at 248-974. 9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your driveway.